All right, what's going on, everyone, and welcome back to another video today. Fellas, have you guys ever seen those promposal videos? If you don't know what a promposal is, essentially, it's when a dude tries to get a little romantic, a little creative, and ask a significant other or, you know, a woman, whoever. Maybe you're gay, dude, okay? Maybe you're gay, you're asking out a guy, I don't know. But either way, essentially, you try to get a little creative and ask them out. Like, here's an example right here. Like, sometimes dudes really go out of their way they put down like a thousand candles that says prom question mark well this might sound a little harsh now that i think about it but i love when these go wrong and before we hop into the video i gotta say i f***ing hate promposals all right back when i was in high school this was a really big thing like every f***ing woman wanted to feel like cinderella and you had to ask them out in a cute way maybe you're a f simp and this is the opportunity of a lifetime for you but dude like i just want to ask you do i really have to put in all this extra work anyways anyways okay i'm getting off track here we're gonna be taking a look at this video here like i said this is my favorite promposal of all time now just to give you guys some context here this guy grabbed his girlfriend and they hopped in the car and he planted these signs on the side of the road so like every 30 seconds she can see a new sign and basically it's just gonna ask her if she'll go to prom with him and uh things things didn't quite go as planned let's take a look here fellas the fuck you say to me you little shit All right, first off, yo, Daniel, fucking hold this L, bitch. As for the woman, I really appreciate how open and honest she is here in this situation. She just straight up says to my man, Daniel, yo, that's a shitty way to ask someone to prom. And then, of course, once she finds out, she starts crying like a little bitch, okay? At least double down and be like, Daniel, that's fucking dumb, you idiot. You know, I'm trying to think how I would feel if that were me in this situation here. And honestly, dude, I just, I can't come up with an answer. Because it depends, like, is she your girlfriend? If she is, then I think I should be able to ask another female to prom. And if it's not my girlfriend, well, I'm gonna turn around, I will drop you off at home, and I will go ask another bitch to prom. But obviously, like, that all depends on how many feelings you have for this girl, and you guys know that shit, okay? Alright, now, as for the video that I actually want to show you guys today, this isn't technically a promposal, alright? I, I don't know what the fuck you'd actually call this. I guess they were dating, like, in high school, and now a couple years later, he wants her back, so this is the best way, I guess, he thought of to ask her? Again, just to give you guys a little bit of context of what's actually happening here, so, he had a female go pick up his girlfriend she's having her stand on a ledge right here as you can see and this guy is going to go through 5,000 goddamn sheets of paper of just fucking bullshit that literally no one cares to read all right bro i'm sorry i'm sorry i have to say that man but it's fucking true but essentially the blonde woman is going to be doing a trust fall where you fall backwards and you let your friend catch you the blonde girl thinks that her friend that's a female is going to be catching her when in reality because she's blindfolded okay she's blindfolded when in reality it's actually gonna be the dude and i just gotta play the video dude okay this is really fucking awkward and it does not go that well in my opinion but you know what let's just play it
This is obviously sped up here. This video is actually like four and a half minutes long. This bitch has been standing here for a little over three and a half minutes. How the fuck do you not question anything? Like you don't hear these papers smacking the ground and go, hey, yo, Brittany, what the fuck is that behind me? Anyways, that's just my two sins. Let's get into the action here. Promise. Yes. Oh my god. All back. Seriously, you've got this. You've got it. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. Do it. Do it. Okay. Ah! Wait, Laura. Laura. Whoa. Laura. 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 What is happening? What is happening? Who is this? Who is this? Laura. Take off your glasses. Who is it? Just. Who is it? Trust me. I just, Seriously, trust I just me. felt a beer. Is that you? Literally, this is only a question that a blonde woman would ask in this situation. She goes, hey, Laura, did you happen to grow a beard in the three and a half minutes I was standing there? That's definitely the dumbest shit I've heard this week. But like, do you guys understand why I say this is so awkward now? I don't, I don't get why when she fell back in his arms, this man decided it was okay to like get up all in her fucking face. I mean, she could literally feel his breath on her nose and then she like starts squirming for help and he's just like awkwardly holding her down i don't know dude i don't know i just i don't fucking like this situation all right i mean like yeah it has a happy ending you know not the type of happy ending most of you are probably thinking about maybe it's just me bro but i probably would have cut that part out of the video it's just it's really awkward and it doesn't really make you look good you know there's nothing like having you on video when a girl is squirming asking who you are while she's blind Folded, and there you are just you know fucking holding her down pinning her against her will yeah i don't know if my employer is gonna want to see that video you feel me but i mean i kind of understand where this guy's coming from she's pretty fucking hot you're definitely a dumbass for leaving her in high school but i don't know fellas i just i just didn't really like the overall vibe this video gave me just like from the beginning this man dropped the whole fucking amazon rainforest on the ground and i don't want to say this video went wrong but it definitely could have gone a lot better but in Anyways, guys, with all that being said, that's going to be it for today's video. Thank you all so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. If you would like to support the channel, consider becoming a member today. But more importantly, be sure to subscribe to the channel if you are new. Leave a like to support the MILFs, and I will catch you guys next time. Later. Suck, my god. That's what happens when you fuck with a gynecologist. Yeah. <laughs> Y'all got fucked yeah, by dude, the poos. Eight years in college does a lot to a man. <laughs>